What's up all you carcomaniacs out there? This is Karakamo, the Forger of Pain. E3, first press conference, EA, and I gotta, gotta tell you, it was a gigantic cock tease because we got a lot of news, but you know, there were like little hints, like, man, I know you want this, but still, like, yes, like I want more. Tell me more, but I'm sure they saving it for the big ass press conference of PlayStation or Xbox. So the first thing we got was Titanfall 2, and by God, it's good news that it's multi-platform. No more of that uh, limited time, bull crap, exclusive stuff. So we get it for the other consoles. In case you're not a sicky and you have to get all consoles, and you don't wanna waste all your money, there you go, multi-platform. Thank you very much, EA. So the other thing we got, it's Madden number 3008 and uh well to be perfectly honest i mean i'm not a madden player i i only know about wrestling so if you want to ask me stuff about pro wrestling that's that's my shit that's the thing so i guess so madam okay okay nice okay next thing fifa now believe it or not i discovered there are other sports apart from pro wrestling and uh so there's this sport called soccer where you kick a ball and not actual, you know, you don't kick the people on their faces, not on purpose, because you can do it sometimes. So anyway, I got to be honest, I got, I think I'm going to get into FIFA because they're having like a story mode and drama. Oh, yes, like we don't need more drama in soccer, right, Cristiano Ronaldo? So, but really, you're like this character and you start from scratch and uh, we saw some footage like like the guy suffering and you have to make all your way up to the ladder and being a Maradona or Messi if you will by the way Messi thank you for that three goals you did to Panama and we help you with the Panama Papers hashtag and we help you with your money and this is how you repay Panamanians but I digress as always so yeah, FIFA looks looks better with this story, career mode, whatever you want to call it. I think I might get into because uh, last time I was into a soccer game, it was Captain Suasa, Super Campeones, as we know it in Panama. But uh, I I wish we could have another Super Campeones. Why don't we have a Captain Suasa for the PlayStation 4? Okay, okay. So the next thing we got is the God of Gaming heard my prayer. And we got another tease of Mass Effect Andromeda. But I mean, it's not a rumor anymore, it's confirmed. And uh, we didn't get like a lot of footage, just like a teaser trailer. Like I said, it was a cock tease conference. And, but it got me interested. I wanna see where they're gonna take the franchise next. And that's all we got, a little bit of a sneak peek. And uh, Star Wars. No, we got a good news here in Star Wars. Like, in case you didn't know, let me put you up to speed. Um, Amy Hemming, the director of Uncharted 1, 2, and 3, uh, she's now working at EA with all of her minions. And uh, over, I think it's over a year from now. And well, you know, Uncharted was a kick-ass game if you ask me. So that's cool to see her working into Star Wars. And they're saying they're bringing a lot of Star Wars games. Let's hope we get that 1313 that was canceled uh, when Lucas Arts, you know, passed away. So yes, I hope we see that. Uh, they say it's gonna be like an adventure action Star Wars game, Uncharted-ish. So yeah, that's good news. We saw, actually this video was like telling you you know, we got these guys working on the Star Wars. We got uh, Respawn, and we got all this kick-ass crew working on this awesome game. And uh, yeah, we didn't see any images, but you know, yes, I'm hyped. I have for Star Wars. And please, Battlefront 2, don't forget the campaign, guys. Like, if you want an, an example of a good Battlefront, remember Battlefront 2 on the PlayStation 2. So yeah, that's my two cents for you guys. And finally, let's talk about Battlefield. Battlefield 1. And correct me if I, I'm wrong, that I know you will in the comments, because that's what YouTube is all about. 
about complaining assholes. Okay, okay. So yes, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think there's not enough uh, World War I games, so it's good. And at the end of the conference, they showed us what I was asking, gameplay footage. So we got a lot of footage, and uh, we saw the, well, in, in Spanish, in Español es Zeppelin. So I'm not sure if in English, that's a blimp. It's, it's like the biggest uh, vehicle created for a, for a game. That's what they're bragging about. And it looked awesome, really. Like, you see, like, the plane, like, and you saw the Zeppelin go down. That's what she said. And it destroyed. And But really, uh, don't take my word for it. Uh, we're going to have some images. They, they finished the conference with Battlefield 1. And I'm going to get into Battlefield again because uh, it was, it's been a while since I get into a first person shooter type of game. Like, you know, Call of Duty -ish or, you know, Battlefield. So guys, that was it for the first day and the first press conference. Let's see what does EA is going to bring up to the table on the gigantic uh, PlayStation or Xbox conference. This is Karkamo, the Forger of Pain, saying like or die.